Welcome to a new fragrance review. Today we're gonna try J by Kai's Perfume. So I finally got my new fragrance from Kai's Perfume, which came with, I uh, forgot the name, but uh, Vanny de Bosch. A little simple of Vanny de Bosch and a little simple of this one too, Vanny de Cedre, her weird little bottle. This one smells more like vanilla than Vanny de Bosch. I will do a review of this one eventually. I haven't tried it yet and I have a lot of things to try. Anyway. We're gonna go with this one today. The bottle, it's simple, it's the same, it's the 15 bomb ml bottle that I'm getting with a long atomizer. So our atomizer are not the best, but for the price of the fragrance and for the usual quality of the fragrance, it, it passed anyway, it's good. And also I'm trying only the small bottle so I don't know if the bigger bottle have a better atomizer or if maybe it's just a small bottle. I don't know where she find those bottles, especially that it's not one that has a twist cap. Maybe it does and it's glued, I don't know, but it doesn't have a twist cap and it, I never found those little bottles, so. So the biggest note I'm picking up is the note of cedar. And uh, when I look at the note breakdown it says Himalayan cedar so I would assume that it's natural cedar and when I smell it overall it doesn't smell super natural but specifically the note of cedar does smell natural. I pick up a little bit of tobacco and a little bit of vanilla but it's mostly in the background and there's some facet of it that I I'm pretty sure I'm picking up the oud, but it's extremely subtle. Now on my skin, what I'm picking up, it's pretty much every note together, kind of fighting with each other, tobacco, vanilla a little bit less, but there's still a sweetness of vanilla, the cedar, and more toward the end, there's some oud. I expected more something, a woody tobacco vanny, but it's not, uh, it's not like that. I have nothing I can compare it to, but it's another world. It's not tobacco vanilla at all. And it's not like tobacco wood neither. For longevity, longevity is average, three to five hours, I would say could go like toward the end of the that that average up to six hour easily. Might be even longer on you now, it's kind of it's winter, my skin is more dry, so it doesn't help with longevity. So I would easily see it lasting seven, eight hours, especially during summer. Projection is good, it's average, a little bubble around you, people will be able to smell you. And an old breakdown, which I already pretty much said, is vanilla, tobacco, cedar, and wood. And where I would see this fragrance, I think it smells, it's, if it's the only fragrance you have, it's gonna be nice as a business fragrance. But if you have a bunch of fragrance, you're gonna find something better. It's not the best at all. It's not even, you know, those that I say they're good, but they're not the best. It's not even at that level. It's kind of average, but it would do the job anyway. I don't think it would be so good as a dating fragrance. Wouldn't be bad neither. I think it's one of those fragrances that are okay at everything. Even the, the summer winter spectrum, it doesn't project like crazy, so it'd be probably better in summer. It would probably have more power during summer. And in winter, it will not be powerful enough. It will be more like dim down. You know, summer, winter, I'm talking about outside and not inside for the smell, it's a winter fragrance. As an everyday fragrance though, I would see it. It's nice, it's different. And if you want something that's different, especially if you're looking this video, you're interested into independent perfumery, so you're already looking for something different. So it could be a nice fragrance that is different and that could be good for everyday use. Personally, I think this is where it belongs in the everyday use 
maybe everyday use during winter, but everyday use none, uh, nonetheless. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If it's okay, so like and share. If you tried this fragrance from Kai's Perfume, or if you tried any other fragrance by Kai's Perfume, and you, maybe you one that you think it's really good and you would like to tell me about it, just write it in the comment. I'll be really happy to hear from you. This is, I don't, I don't plan buying more fragrance. There's maybe one other that sounds interesting, but I'm not quite sure I would buy it, at least not right away. There's this one too, that I have to review. So if there's one that you think it's really good and I need to try and you want to have a review, write it in the comment or I will probably not buy it and review it. So, hope you enjoyed this video and see you soon.